I'm mostly naming that I am interested in stepping into my stature because I say yes to my agreements and they mean something to me and they mean something to the people I'm making them with. So when I say yes to you, that I will stay in the stature of a priestess, when I will honor my primal spirituality, which is the spirituality I was born with before it got all messed up or stolen or oppressed, when I say I am dedicated to that, I mean it. I have found myself being under a lot of pressure these days because my life as it was a month ago, is not the same. I got a whole bunch of new friends living around here. And they are expecting things, not in the sense of pressure of demand, but they are expecting me to keep my word. And you know, when you stand up here and you say you will, there is um, even more pressure. But I want to say there is nothing I want more in my life than to stand in the authority of my being and say, I am a priestess of the Most High. You want to do that with me? Many times people start analyzing, well, what the heck does that mean? So I'll give you the simple explanation. It means I will stay in the stature of the highest I know, the truth and the love that I know, and let all the parts of me come with me. And I will hover and create with my friends who want to do that with me and see how the world will change and come back to its true state. There is a vibrational pattern of primal spirituality that is setting the pattern. Not my great ideas and not the way in which I'm thinking right now that isn't willing to be transformed or moved. It has to be oriented in the highest place I know, so I'm going there. And it's not some invisible place, and it's not some place where all of a sudden I'm getting to be six foot tall. It is a vibrational place. It is a living temple. It is home. It is my holy home. And I will keep it and care for it and create it with everyone and anyone who wants to do that with me. It is our holy home. And there are people online, people on the computer, there are people I haven't met who are interested and they're doing it with me and I already know them even though I've never met them because they are keeping and honoring their holy home. Because there is a lot I want to do with my life. And there is a lot that can only happen if there's agreement about maintaining that and living there together. Do you agree? Anybody think that you can do it otherwise? Uh, otherwise, we're having all these conflicts about my religion, your religion, what you say, what I say. It's happening in our world everywhere. People are manipulating the world based on their interpretation of what it means. We have to know something else, and it is a vibrational experience of communion with the invisible and the holiest thing you know. Keep coming. And I'm not saying keep coming to me. Keep coming to your highest and finest, to the beloved that you know is you. It's you. It's you.